just shy of midfield. Roethlisberger and McDonald here over the middle. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. A gain of 13, it's a first down. Here's Roethlisberger to throw. Oh, he's trying for Smith-Schuster, but it's intercepted. Xavier Woods with a pick. And he will bring this across midfield to the 49-yard line. The good old cover three defense, partner. When you start playing football as a safety, that's the first thing you're taught. Middle of the field, be as deep as the deepest receiver in any zone, and break on the football when it's thrown, and pick it off, just as we saw there. And now Dallas gets set to take the field. And what a time to get the ball on a turnover here in the final minute of the first half. Yeah, great starting position, too. And if they can catch it. And now this is intercepted. My goodness. Picked off by Ryan Shazier. And now off to the races down the right side. And he's in for six and a Steeler touchdown. So a dangerous pass over the middle into zone coverage, and it bit him hard. And what's really difficult when you throw it in that direction and versus that zone, that means the linebackers have gotten to their spot, gotten their heads back around, and they can see the quarterback and everything in front of them. And they took big advantage of it, went in the other direction, excellent blocking, and picked up a touchdown. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And nice work on the return as they'll start their drive just past the 30-yard line. Just 11 seconds to go in the half as they have it first and 10. Back to it after the pick six, Prescott. And there is Amari Cooper, his first catch. Oh, he sheds himself free. And he's in for the touchdown on the final play of the first half. The prayer is answered. How did they get that done? And with the clock at all zeros, they get the touchdown to make this just a one-score game into the lockers. And you know what else it does besides boost their confidence? It doesn't change your game plan any. See, if they're down bigger going into the half, you may have to revise what you plan to do in the second. But now in this spot, within one score and striking distance, ah, you go ahead and keep playing and do what you've worked on all week long. This fielded a few yards into the end zone. And he'll bring it back to just about the 25. Call it the 24-yard line. Big Ben and the Steelers with a first and 10 at their own 24. Out of the gun, it's Roethlisberger. Open man right side is Smith-Schuster, complete. Pass the 20. And into the end zone. Touchdown, Pittsburgh. Juju Smith-Schuster, 76 yards. And the Steelers find a way to stretch their lead. Boswell good with the extra point. And the decision to just kick the extra point winds up successful. Boswell now to kick it away after the touchdown. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And he'll be brought down at the 23, make it the 24-yard line. Prescott on first down. And this one hauled in by Tavon Austin. And he's brought down, getting this one up to about the 35. A gain of 11 to kick off the drive, and it's a quick first down. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. Out of the gun, it's Elliott. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. 
Well, they still have time to get him established, but in my estimation, they've got to pick up the urgency here. They've got to get quickly in and out of the huddle and run off a bunch more plays. They'll run with Elliott and able to get a couple as he's across the 40 to the 41. I'd say they've got to find a way to get him going. He's such a big part of their offense. I wonder if they might throw it a little and come back to the run. Anything, because you're right, he's pretty much been completely neutralized. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. And this is caught by Witten, the tight end. And he's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. Called at a very strong gain of 24. From the shotgun, it's Prescott. And the Steeler pressure too much here. He's going to go down. Cam Hayward, always a force, got back there for the sack. And we say it all the time, have to be able to get rid of the ball sooner than that. You have to help your offensive line out. They're going to protect you as best they can. And if you're getting three to five seconds to throw the ball, they're doing a really nice job. But when you hold it and give up a sack, you're really almost discrediting their work. To try again after the sack. Prescott got his man complete over the middle. It's Elliott. And he'll get this one down near the 20-yard line. Just shy of the 20. 25 yards there on the catch and run. throw for Prescott. Buying time to his left. Oh, Prescott stripped. And a big turnover there is... His guys will get the football back. Big Ben and the Steelers with a first and 10 at their own 13. They start with a give to Connor. And just not a ton of room to work with. He'll give it to the 15 for a gain of two. Sometimes with the running game, you've just got to stick with it. Look, it's the third quarter, no time to panic. But that also doesn't mean you just do it the same way you've been doing it the entire ball game. Maybe change up some blocking assignments or run a few different plays, but stay with the overall essence of the running game. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. And the Steelers on third down. They've hit two for four thus far. This is third and eight. To throw here, Roethlisberger. Completing it to the right side, Johnson. So he fought off the tackle, and that effort gives him the first before he's brought down. It's a nine-yard gain, and it keeps the drive moving. On first down, Connor trying to bounce it outside, but he's only able to get it back to the line of scrimmage. Tackle there by Leighton Vander Esch. Right now they struggled to get him rolling on the ground in the first half, and that's sort of continuing here in the third quarter. Yeah, but I don't think it's time to abandon the running game. I would say keep feeding the horse, and I believe he'll eventually reward them, especially as we get deeper in the game. And he's out of bounds, but not before a big pickup that time on what's going to wind up being the final play of the third quarter. Ready? Blue 30? Check, check. Watch 54. Watch 54. On first down, it's Roethlisberger. And intercepted. Maybe the turning point they need. Picked off by Anthony Brown. And he takes this one back into the end zone. And the Cowboy defense has a touchdown. Well, don't change that channel just yet. This one may have gotten a bit more interesting. Put down the remote, put down the clicker. This one looked like it was over. It looked like they were ready to seal the deal. But in doing so, by pitching it around a little bit, it cost them. We could have a great finish. So 
So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. it. The Steelers take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Big Ben and the Steelers with a first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The drive will start with Connor. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. Right off the bat, it's a first down to start the drive, 12 yards. Well, it is our business to analyze what we saw out there. And on that play, I saw a defense staying in base, not taking a chance, not blitzing in a situation where they absolutely need the football back. That's either a case of overthinking it or not thinking it through. If you do blitz, do you have to be careful about where you're coming from or are you just coming from all angles? You have to be careful about where you're coming from, obviously, but at this stage, you have to take a few chances as well. Under four to go now as the clock runs and they come up on second down. On second down, Connor looking for space. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line of scrimmage and no more. Jalen Smith, the Notre Dame man, in on the tackle. This is third and two. Maybe the biggest play in this football game. From the shotgun, it's Roethlisberger. He's going to flip that out to the flat. It's complete. We've got this. And he will have the first down, but he winds up paying for it pretty good. From the gun, a give to Connor. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second. If nothing else, they've already taken a couple minutes off the clock here already as they come up second down. From the gun, it's Roethlisberger. Open man completes it to Smith-Schuster. And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. Three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So the Steelers with the football as we get you reset. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. This is Connor. Jukes by at the 20. And they'll work it inside the 15-yard line before it's all said and done. Another big gainer that time. This one goes for 19 yards. But they picked up a little bit of yardage there, and now, in this situation, should be in no hurry to run a play really fast. Let the clock wind down. And not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and ten. Right back to Connor here on first. And I think this defense knew what was coming as he is smothered behind the line. Well, partner, I guess sometimes it's just a matter of philosophy. Some say run until they absolutely stop you, and others say, well, when you think they're about to stop you, fool them a little bit. I guess they should have tried. And he's in. Touchdown, Steelers. James Conner, his second touchdown of the afternoon, and the Steelers are going to add on to their lead.
Well, that was absolutely ideal for them, wasn't it? Trying to salt this game away. I think one of my kids just graduated in the amount of time they had the football. That was absolutely impressive. Everybody wants those salt away the game drives. What makes them successful? Well, when you're able to mix run pass, when you're able to control the football and stay at Haynes,